Hi, this is Geert Jan from the NetBeans team. In this screencast, you're going to see how Grunt works inside NetBeans IDE. First, go to the command line, which can be inside NetBeans in the terminal emulator, and run Grunt to make sure that it's installed. If it's not installed, use npm install to install Grunt, and then you can get started. Create an HTML5 application. In this case, we're going to use Angular Seed as our starting point. And once you have that, make sure to set the dependencies that you need for, in this case, cleaning and building tasks. And we're just expanding the application. And the next thing we're going to do is jump into the package.json file and add in there the two dependencies for the grunt tasks for cleaning and for copying and for building those kinds of tasks. I can use this keyboard shortcut that you see there because I have created a code template. Uh, the code template that you see here, I have defined myself, GR1, and I've set it to those two dependencies that we're going to need. In the JavaScript code templates, I've added a code template for defining a grunt file that contains build, clean, and copy tasks. So I'm all set up. Um, we've added the dependencies. We are now going to create our grunt file. So this is also new in NetBeans, the fact that you can create a grunt file that is put into the correct place. And here are the tasks, the copy and the build, and the clean. And as you can also see here, which is also new, we can map the project level commands build clean to these to any command we have inside of our grunt file. Now we switch and we use npm install and bower install inside NetBeans to get all our dependencies, Angular as well as these grunt tasks. Once we've done that, we take a quick look. So what does copy mean? What does clean mean? Copy means we will create a build folder. Clean means we'll remove it. And then finally, we have a task for combining the two, cleaning and copying. Next, let's try out these tasks. So you can see that they're integrated into our project. So the build has been performed. And when we go back and use our clean project command, that is mapped to our clean task in our grunt file. And similarly, when we combine the two, a clean and a build is done. What's also nice is that each of these commands can be mapped to keyboard shortcuts. So you could type F6 or something and then the build could be performed, and F5, and then the clean is performed. With that, you can integrate Grunt.